Here's a great one. This 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 one takes the cake. Uh, I really wish I would have gotten video on this, but uh, you guys are gonna love this one. Family pet attacks toddler over the weekend. Child has surgery to reattach ear and over 200 stitches in his face. Uh, a Mount Carmel toddler, two years old, had just woken up Saturday morning at approximately 9.30 a.m. and walked into the kitchen of the family home in Cherry Street Estates when the tragedy occurred. His grandmother, Patty Lindsay, told the register late Monday afternoon. Now, I'm keeping it up here because I would, I'm, I'm uh, surprising you guys to see what kind of breed this dog was that attacked. So, you guys are going to love this one. He just walked into the kitchen and he woke up and the dog attacked him for no reason, said Lindsay, and bit him three times. Here we go. The dog in question is a four-year-old golden retriever that the family had only for approximately two weeks, according to Lindsay. She explained that her daughter, Brandy, had acquired the dog while at a vet's office. She, Brandy, was talking with a man at the vet clinic who had the golden retriever with him. She said she would like to have a dog like that. The man explained that he needed to get rid of the dog because his, li his wife was expecting a baby. Goodman took the dog home with her. Following the attack Saturday morning, Branson, Branson which is the, the child, had to be taken to Deaconess Hospital in Evansville, Indiana by a life flight helicopter. He had to undergo surgery to reattach his ear, which was severe, which was severed almost entirely, she said, and was only connected a little bit at the very top and bottom. It wasn't attached at the back at all. In addition to suffering the bite trauma to his ear, Branson was also bitten in the face and had to re receive over 200 stitches to that area. Uh, doctors have told the family that he may have permanent nerve damage on the right side of his face. Branson is still hospitalized in Evansville, and the dog was taken by Wabash County Animal Control um, Officer Skidmore. Skidmore said the dog will be put to sleep. Let me uh, zoom in on this. Uh, crap. It's too blurry. The dog in question is a four-year-old golden retriever. Golden retriever. You gotta love that. If golden retrievers are now starting to bite bite our ears off, what's the world coming to? That sucks. I'm done.